So then it's recording, all right? It's recording right now. Is it? Yeah. Oh, it's, shit. It's been recording for like the last 20 minutes. All right, cool. <laughs> <laughs> well, should we get on with this unboxing? Yeah, so uh, as we're continuing here with this mega unboxing of the turtles, Professor M is here with this Mr. J guy. I don't know. Who. Anyways, um, so we've got. You got this on eBay, right? Heck yeah. Um, okay. Um, it's kind of loose in here, though. Yeah. Uh, kind of surprising, but yeah, it's eBay. What do you expect, right? sucks but anyways um wow okay <laughs> uh that glare is a lot more than i thought it was going to be um well i'll work on that guys we're, we're whatever we're starting we're starting the videos we're starting the unboxing videos so this is the secret of the ooze super shredder he comes with his uh, cape spear uh mutagen canister and seven interchangeable hands did he change his hands as many times well, yeah, if you want to pick his nose or something. Oh, well, yeah, I mean, you got to pick your nose. So let's go ahead and... Uh, uh, what? You, you got this off eBay, right? Yeah, pay 200 bucks for it. $200 for this? Uh, yeah, because it just came out and you can't find them anywhere. I'll give you 20 for the for the Ranger. What Ranger? Um, That Ranger. What the fuck? <laughs> I trusted him. <laughs> they, they told me that it was like... <laughs> Mint box. Oh, oh, it's mint. All right. Uh, so, <clears throat> um, so anyway, so this, uh, okay, Lord, all right. So this is now a uh, Lord Draken uh, review. Uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, Fooled you. Fool. Okay. Okay. No, I don't know. That's that's. Um, you mean Kevin Nash? The, uh, Kevin Nash. So we got it right here. Uh, we're gonna pull. Um, all the hands started popping yeah. off. Uh, I'm not gonna pull the hands off. Uh, mine's coming later. This is Mr. J's, so I'll probably break it like I broke his other one. Sorry about that, by the way. All right, so he, does he come out really easy? Oh no, he's tight in here. Well, yeah. Well, it wouldn't be an unboxing video if he didn't, you know, if he was already out of the box. Well, but he's, technically he's already out of the box, but still. Oh my God. Why am I so blurry? Subscribe now. Say something. Something. Seriously. <laughs> <laughs> So let's go ahead and let's go look at this. This, I'm not, I'm not gonna lie, this cape is amazing. I like this cape. The fabric is really good. I do still like that other one though, like the the, 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 the ripples. I, I like the ripples. Um, the hands, all right, let's see how easy these hands come out. Okay, so not very, so you probably need to use a little, like a, like a, like a, um, a little bit of heat. No, I. Maybe uh, to loosen it, because I, I, I feel like if I'm gonna pull this, I'll break it. It's, it's one of those things where I actually watched a video, I think it was Shardimus Prime. Uh, he talked about, yes, you could use a a, uh, a hair dryer. Yeah, that's... The... But, uh... Okay, so that's very tight, so you want to be careful dude, there. He came out of the package, too, so... Well, know. yeah, I mean, I like it when they're... Okay, oh, I like that. I like how he has... Okay, so he has full... I mean, obviously, you're not going to pose him like that. Oh, my God, the turtles broke my leg. Yeah, no, like so the Shardimus Prime video I had watched, uh, it's a five-year-old video, and it was actually with just 
a mark based on some Marvel Legends figures, but it will work on the NECA figures where it basically you he had uh, used like a tea kettle to heat up water. Mm. And I just found out that regular hot water will work, but you want to put the figure like in like a Ziploc bag and then kind of let them rest. Right. In the water and it will loosen up their. Uh, Wakanda forever. That's a cultural appropriation. Jack Knife Powerball. <laughs> Wait, he's gotta be like Undertaker. Wait, leaves. <laughs> no, hold on. Wait, he's Undertaker. <laughs> oh, that was more like the uh, a bad parody of the. Uh, Flat and scene from uh, Breakfast Club. Right. Look, 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 look at that. Look at that. I wish I had abs like that. I guess I could if I just go and get a bodysuit and paint them on, right? <laughs> it's amazing. It's amazing. I wish you had brought the other one. I didn't think about it. It would. I mean, because like the comparison, like between like when he goes from like Schroeder to this, like, like I mean the fact that even like this mutated with him. Now here's a question. Now it it. It looks like, it looks like on the helmet that it yeah, you is. See, you, see, you see under. Yeah, you can see underneath. It's attached. Like I can't take the helmet off. It's fully attached because the other one had the the yeah. face mask that came off, and that's obvious for the movie because you know he's like, oh, take it off. You you know pulls that off. You know does the whole Batman voice thing um, before it was Batman. So technically, it's the Shredder voice, not Batman voice. It's the Shredder but, voice. Technically, however, in the Nickelodeon uh, live action, it was like, oh, 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 he's doing his Batman voice again. I see that movie once. Right. <laughs> um, yeah, I, I mean, it's, it's, it's uh, obviously he's going to have, you know, you got to be very careful with these figures. I mean, they're not meant for kids. They're not meant for your 10 year olds, okay? Unless your 10 year old is like really, really into Ninja Turtles. Uh, foot articulation, um, very limited. I mean, it's not limited, but I mean, it's limited because it's so tight and I don't want to pull on it any more than I already am. Like, you can twist it about there, about there, and the other foot is about the same, you know, then uh, this is where people screw up. And I'm going to point this out right now for those of you, if you're still watching the video, kudos to you. This is where people make the mistake. They try to bend this part right here by going like this. You're going to break it. You have to be very careful. You have to go like this. And it's, it's, it's very... You have to be careful. very careful, I, and I have experience doing this because I've have I've had figures like this before. Like some of the premium He-Man figures that I had back in the day were like that. So when you move it back, make sure you grip it really good and go slow. You, you just go slow, go slow. You don't need to. Once you've done it a couple times, it loosens up, and that's and that's pretty much the same with any figure. Like it's you can you can I don't know if you can hear it. Yeah, you guys can hear it. Like you hear that? I don't know if that's being picked up on the microphone, but yeah, that's that's like. Like I said, you know, you... I like it. It's it's a really cool figure. I mean, the head, the head sculpt is really good. This is like the best head sculpt for. I think this is besides like the original 1990. Is it 92? Uh, 1990, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle movie. He never had this staff. This is this 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 now here's a little thing and if you guys don't believe me you can go oh that was me <laughs> i was about to yell at you <laughs> you turn your phone off during recording oh um, <laughs> so this is actually in the movie but it's in the background so the scene in the begin like in the garage not the garage at the um the junkyard when they're when they're like you know in the training scene where like Kano goes down there and everything and Shredder pops out and everything, uh, the scene not that scene but the scene later when he's scrap when he's uh, when he's making these little these little ridges in his helmet like he's fixing his helmet, the, you can see this in the background like on the wall like with other weapons. So this is in the movie. It's just not something that Shredder actually used. Like, he didn't have any weapons. Like the only the only weapon he had, which I'm surprised they didn't give him his. Now I have to watch that movie again because I'm pretty sure at least oh. one hand he had a claw on. Well, or did he not have it on? Not when he's Super Shredder. Uh, it looks like this wants to pop off. Like it's higher than the other side, but that could just be the design too. Like it feels like it moves. 
like it's on there. Like it feels like, like it, doesn't it look like it's a little? It's one side's a little higher than the other. Like the chest piece. Thanks, because you have them kind of angled a little weird. Yeah, it might be the yeah. Anyways, um, so the arms, yep, those are really tight. So I'm not gonna bring them. I'm not gonna pull them. Uh, the one thing I, the only complaint that I have, and I don't know how well you guys can see it on camera, but I'm seeing it. He has bug eyes. <laughs> That's kind of how it looked in the movie. I, I guess it did. I mean, I guess it was so dark that I guess I never noticed those bug eyes. Well, I fact, wish I could zoom in. And, like, I'm still getting used to this camera, guys. This is the first the, real recording. Uh, the fact that it was Kevin Nash, and I'm pretty sure they wanted to hide that it wasn't a giant Asian Wait, figure. it was Kevin Nash that did the scene? Yeah, that's why I said it was a Kevin was? Nash figure. Oh, that's right. It was, wasn't it? Yep. Oh, my yeah. God. That's right. I remember they said it was a wrestler, but I couldn't remember which wrestler it was. But, yes, for those of you who didn't know, he was uncredited. In the movie, because it's not in the credits, but it was Kevin so, Nash. I was, I think, we watching it last week. I was, I thought it was in there. But Did he have it? In? I thought it was uncredited. I thought the only, I thought, okay. So here's the thing: I did not know that it was Kevin Nash until about like five years ago. And the only reason I knew that, or found that out, is because they were doing, in, they were, they were talking about uh, re-releasing the movies, like the original movie or whatever. And they were talking about it. They they said, you know, was Super Shredder ever going to be in the new Ninja Turtle films? And they said they pro they probably weren't going to do it. And they said originally Kevin Nash, uh, he they said if they, if they ever did Super Shredder again, that Kevin Nash would like to reprise his role. And when asked that question, Kevin they said, yeah, he was uncredited. And the only way that it's been proven is that the directors confirmed that yes, it was Kevin Nash. But he wasn't a really big. He wasn't as big as he was. You know, obviously now. But back then, he was just, like, still new wrestler. and Not new, but, I mean, he was, I think, Diesel back then. And uh, I'm not sure if he was actually... I don't think he was... Yeah, I don't think he was Diesel. I think he had just started in the WWF or WWE, whatever. So, yeah, I like it. The head can do a full turn, even with the... With the ooh. There's a little click there. I don't know where that click was. And the head falls off. <laughs> So yeah, you can you can you can give him you can give him some really dramatic poses, as you can see here. But yeah, I really I really I really like it. It's it's a good figure. It feels really nice. Well, I'm you know it feels really nice. <laughs> I mean this the de the that detail is I know right. I say that as I'm rubbing his crotch. Uh, <laughs> the detail is really like it's cr it's really crazy how quickly in the movie that change happened. I mean, it seems like it happened really quickly, but I, I, I feel like, you know, movie timeline-wise, it probably took a while. So, there you go, guys. There's, there's Super Shredder. Um, does he stand on his own? Without falling over on his butt? He's gonna fall over on his butt. It might just be my mat. Um, he does have to lean forward just a bit, it looks like. Yeah, he does have to lean forward just a bit. Let's move the camera back. Yeah, he does have to move back just a bit, guys. And that's okay, though. I'm totally okay with that. So, yeah, there you go. There's a... There is a cool action shot of Shredder.